What's going on YouTube? Back with another video today. And today I wanna to talk about the 2020 Chevy 2500 that Chevrolet just released to the public. Not for sale yet, but they just released these latest pictures, which if you talk to a different person each day, they're gonna give you a different opinion. Many people so far have not liked this truck, but I, I gotta tell you, I, I really, really, really like it. And I think it's a huge step for Chevrolet. GM as a whole, they're taking a step into a market that has been heavily dominated by Ford up to this point. Yes, Chevrolet has had three quarter ton and one ton vehicles, but this, in my opinion, is a truck that's beefier, more well built, uh, more capable. And as the numbers get released, we will be able to see more of that. But the pure presence of this truck is on par with what Ford has been putting out for the past 20 years now. So I'm really excited to see these go head to head once it is on the streets, once it is released to the public, really excited. So initially the first one to debut, uh, Chevy released the LT model. And at first I gotta say that it, it was a little off catching, um, definitely a style that many people weren't prepared for. Something that was <laughs> completely different than the, the recent 1500 design, just the structure, the headline, lights the grill as you can see is just very different but you know the following day Chevy did release the renderings for the high country model which in my opinion are absolutely sick and the way the grill looks the way the headlights look the LED headlights I just think this thing's gonna be really 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 nasty I think a lot of people are just gonna fall in love with this truck I think it's gonna dominate that segment of trucks because it is just absolutely amazing my opinion I know everyone feels differently but I guarantee over time, this thing is really gonna catch on. But moving forward also, what we've seen is a, a few people so far, and this one specifically here, you can see in the slides that I have attached a rendering of this truck that's been lifted and outfitted with a number of different things. And these things look absolutely amazing lifted up and I cannot wait to see one in person. I think it's gonna look absolutely amazing. This one is very extreme. They did put a straight axle on this rendering. So I know not too many people are gonna do that. Many people are gonna get the level, the six inch lift, but other, you know, I, I just can't wait. I'm, I'm really probably of all of the truck releases in the past, say five, to 10 years this one probably sparks my interest the most i'm really excited to see it hit the streets i'm really excited to see the response to the public i really feel that this thing is going to catch on and just put gm in a place to really compete hard with ford for that three for that three quarter ton one ton truck market just my opinion though I know that many people love the, the straight axle on the Fords. Um, you know, I do wish Chevy GM had an option there, you know, whether it be in the one ton, but you know, I, I think that these trucks are very capable and I'm really excited to see more specs down the road. It has been said that they are gonna be outfitted with the most recent 6.6 .6 liter Duramax engine, as well as a, a gas model. I don't know that they've released that yet, but more than likely it will be the 6.2. Do not anticipate anything larger than that, but either way, that is a great engine. That being said, I'd like to hear everyone's thoughts and opinions down below. Please let me know what you think. Do you think Chevy or GM bit off too much with this? Do you think it's too extreme or do you like it? Um, you know, my personal opinion is I really, really like it. I think it's cool. I think it's, you know, groundbreaking. I think it's exactly what Chevy needed to really start catching people's attention again. Ford's been making such big moves over the past forever. <laughs> I mean, they're always pushing pushing the truck market to different levels, you know. So I'm, I'm really excited to see this from GM. But yeah, let me know in the thoughts below. Let me know your thoughts below and we will uh, discuss. Yeah, guys, thanks again. Please subscribe if you like this video. There's gonna be more content coming. I uh, get a feeling that more people do enjoy the reviews and discussions, so we will stick to that format for now. If there is something else that you would like to see on the channel, please let me know. Thanks, guys. Have a great day.